Hey guys, what's up? It is me, Jen the Sim, and I'm back with another Sims 4 Let's Play part in our Sims 4 Let's Play series, and I am moving on to part 20 in our Let's Play part currently. So, um, in the last part, which I just recorded actually, I'm actually pre-recording this part because I have stuff to do over the weekend and I will not be able to record, so I figured I may as well get as much recording done as I can. So, without, um, why was I going to say that? No, with what I was going to say was, in the last part, um, we sort of, m kind of, maybe had an affair, scandalous, I know. But we did actually indeed have an affair with Mortimer Goth to get under Bella Goth's skin for ruining her our wedding in every way possible. She just came, ruined the whole damn wedding for us. So she deserved to, like, karma came back to her and bit her back ten times worse. So... That's what happened in the last part. We also tried for a baby, and that didn't work out too well, so we ended up going to kick over a trash can because we were so angry at the fact that we were not pregnant. But um, we are here, and I'm actually going to go ahead and first things first, try for a baby because never mind, actually. I just realized that we can't do that because we're so uncomfortable at the moment. So I'm actually going to have Alex go ahead, take a quick bath, then go get some cereal. And then, um, she is going to actually try to sex her husband up a little and hopefully get knocked up. Will it actually happen? I am not 100% sure on that one, but I hope it would because I want to have another baby pretty soon here. And right before I started filming this part, I actually went up to Nico's room and here was a little bland, so I added these three um, wall hangings in. I don't know really what they are exactly. I just think there's something for decoration. So I go went ahead and added those just so that it's not a blank wall. Um, I think it looks good. Um, and then I also went on to do this bathroom up here, but obviously you can probably tell that we ran out of money. Shocker. I know it happens every single time I try to furnish any sort of room. But that is what happened, and we do not have a toilet up here currently, so that is something that we will have to work on getting for the upstairs bathroom, and then we will also have to work on making a nursery pretty soon here. Because, um, actually maybe not, because I remember it saying that it's almost Corbin's birthday, and, um, and when Corbin becomes, um, a child obviously he will not need a crib so we can just use this crib for the next baby so um instead of having to make another nursery we will probably just have to make up um another child's room that's probably what it will end up being like um to be quite honest i am pretty sure that's just how it's going to work out and Nico is so annoying. I don't know if he doesn't have anything to do, but I feel like getting him some toy or some sort of thing to use during the day because I feel like he is just some bored kid. But there's no toys. I feel like there's nothing that he can use possibly. So, and we can't afford anything to add that much. We only have 128 simoleons, so I think we can wait on that. Just let the kid, um, just let the kid, um, be tortured a few more days. I mean, it's fine, really. Nobody really cares about you. Get the hell out of our room. This is not going to be strike four for you and seeing your parents doing the nasty. Honestly, we do not have time for you to be walking in on us naked. Okay, so... How about you keep your damn toys up in your room and stop bringing in your damn toys to the downstairs? I put them in your room for a reason. They are yours, not anybody else's, you fucking kid. Honestly, he keeps bringing his damn toys downstairs and putting them in random ass places. So, if he would actually listen to me, he would. Oh, gosh, guys. Look what just happened. Shoot, I did not mean to do that, guys. I do not know what just happened. Whatever then. Okay. So, um. I guess Ryan just feels the need to be bathing up here. But, um, 
we can actually take a pregnancy test now. Um, I don't know if we should because we are quite hungry at the moment. So we should probably go serve dinner for our family. Mac and cheese sounds appealing to me right now. So I will go have her make that. I wish I could have some mac and cheese right now in real life. That just sounds on point at the moment. Um, but I think Ryan... No, he does not have work today. He is off. So that gives us a perfect opportunity to actually go and work on our video gaming skill to bring that up a tad for work by a whole... He needs to bring it up from level 5 to a 6, so I will have him go work on that at the moment. And then I will have Alex go to the bathroom, then she's going to take a bath, and then she is going to go back and take a pregnancy test, and hopefully we get good results. Kid, what the hell is your freaking problem? Stop walking in on your damn mom while she's pissing on the toilet. This kid has freaking problems. Gosh. I feel like the baby's not happy right now. He's crying. Probably because of Nico's ugly face is what he's crying at. So, I'm going to have, um... I'm going to have Alex go over and take the pregnancy test like I told her to do about five times now. And hopefully she actually... What the hell is your problem? Oh, that's your problem. Repair that. Then sell these apples that you just got. Um, I don't think... Evolve that. Water 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 weed that a little um um no do not get in your damn bed you need oh my gosh guys i wonder if she's pregnant i'm really it's like annoying me right now i want to know if she's pregnant at the moment we also need to enter um a game tournament so we are going to go ahead and do that um we are going to do pro refuge i don't even know what that even means but we'll go ahead and do that very quickly and hopefully we place in it because we need a place in at least three video game tournaments before we get our next promotion so i hope that that will come to us soon and i just realized that we should probably upgrade this penguin tv sometime soon whenever we get the um the correct funds for that we will definitely go ahead and upgrade that because it's kind of embarrassing that we have a penguin TV in our master bedroom. Um, you know, it may just be me, but I would not want that if I were um, living in a master bedroom. I would not want a freaking puny ass penguin TV. So I'm going to have her go tend to her garden now that it is four in the morning. Um, what is your problem, dude? Oh, that's your problem, right? I keep forgetting. Repair this damn thing. Get on your hands and knees and repair that toilet for, the, like, the 20th time. Um, and then you need to go use that toilet. And then you need to go use that toilet to take a pregnancy test and see if you're pregnant. Because, yay, we're pregnant, guys. That was quick. Um, serve breakfast and then go serve you... you Fruit? I cannot talk right now. Fruit and yogurt parfait. Um, we will go ahead and do that while this baby um, just casually dies because it's starving to death. Just kidding. It is not going to die. We will keep it alive. Um, so Ryan's going to need to go do that. Then he's going to go need to eat a serving of a fruit parfait. And then he's going to go sleep. And then I'm going to have Alex go ahead and put this away once Ryan comes in here and grabs his own serving of it. And then we will head off to bed because we are all really tired here. I guess we did not get that much sleep last night. But um, Nico's off to school for the day. Hopefully he did his homework. Who knows? That kid is just off his rocker most of the time. Um, so I realize that this bathroom is a complete disaster, so we probably need to go throw away these parts, mop it up, and then clean the bathtub, um, after we, of course, are done sleeping, and then we should also probably go clean up the house a tad bit more because it seems to be a disaster, and then, Ryan, I don't know what you are exactly doing, but you need to go be sleeping because you have work in about, um, what is it now, seven hours. So hopefully you have enough time to actually um, sleep. 
What the hell are you doing? I keep telling you to sleep and you keep getting up. Go take a damn bath if that's what you want to do. I don't know at this point. You are an idiot. Um, are any of our plants... Okay, the banana tree seems to be ready to be harvested, so we will have to do that eventually. Once we, um... Once we get done doing everything else we need to do, so I'm going to have Ryan go head off to bed because he needs to get some rest in before he heads off to work for the day, and then Alex has enough rest for the day, so she is good on that, and um, let me see if she has a baby bump quite yet. Probably not. A little tiny bit one. Um... We just gave up on losing the baby weight because, quite frankly, if we're just going to keep getting knocked up, we might as well just not lose the baby weight in between because there's no use in that, honestly. Um, so she's just going to do her normal duties of doing stuff around the house, and then she's going to go clean up and then probably go eat because she needs to feed for two now. Um since we are indeed pregnant. Hopefully we do have a girl. I know I've said that a couple times now, but my goal is to have at least one girl and one boy, and obviously we've already had two boys at this point, so a girl sounds awesome right now. And I'm going to have her go work on her garden a bit more. Um, seems like that's what's needed at this point. And then Ryan also is needs to go eat before he heads off to his work. Um... Probably just eat a fruit parfait and then head off to his job and hopefully bring in some cash for us because um, that seems like something that we need right now because we need to be making another bedroom just about now because Corbin is about to age up, I think. In the next two or three days, he should be aging up into a child. So is that exciting? Um I don't know. I feel like he's growing up really fast already, but we will be having another baby soon, so we will probably constantly be having kids. I feel like I just rambled on for about a while, so, um, yeah, um, that is, okay, how about you go do your homework and stop rotting your brain by just standing, staring at a TV and make use of your time do your homework kid i honestly don't even have time for you right now <clears throat> most of the guy most of you guys said that you liked well most of the guys who actually talked about the dining room said that they liked um it so i will go ahead and keep it how it is right now um i think i do like it actually it's pretty cozy i would say i like the colors it's really warm and i like the orange chairs they add like a different touch um i usually don't do um very interesting colors in my houses, so orange is definitely something different, um, but it's a good different. I like how the dining room turned out. It's on a budget, but it's also very cozy at the same time, I would say. We just need to figure out something to put in between these windows, maybe like a china cabinet or something. I honestly don't know. Whenever we do f save up enough money, which should be pretty soon here. Yep, I spoke very soon about that. So let me see if we can add anything possibly into here right now, just while I'm thinking about it. Um, maybe something like that would work, or like a hutch, I guess, is what it's called. I did not know that, but um, let me see what I think looks better best i think that i might just go with this for right now it doesn't seem to be too expensive but it also seems to give a nice touch to it um just because i don't want anything to be i think i like that tell me if you guys like that if you don't want it there tell me and i will probably go ahead and remove it because i want to honestly listen to what you guys have to say because i'm honestly doing this for you guys so let me know what you think about the dining room not too much change just that one little piece of furniture um I added in but if you don't like it tell me be honest with me I will go ahead and remove that um, I honestly don't care just be honest I would love that um why are you already up it is like literally 3 in the morning go the hell away from me okay actually now that I'm thinking about it um, we can go ahead and buy a toilet for the upstairs bathroom um, so that we don't have this annoying little kid always using our shit um, I want to get a brown toilet, but I cannot figure out 
Okay, you know what? We're just gonna stick with um that. We're just gonna stick with the regular original style. Um, and then we are gonna go ahead and actually add a quick little um rug into here. Um, yeah, that looks good. And then probably just like a wall decoration or something. I honestly don't know. Maybe like a towel um hanger. Maybe that would be good. Um, oh, a mirror also would probably be beneficial to them. Um, I'm going to go ahead and add that in right now, right here. And then over the, by the toilet, I don't know what could be good. Um, uh, maybe just something like that would be good. Um, 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 that actually looks fine, actually. So we will go ahead and add that in, and that seems to be all of our money. That was $500, so that's kind of a waste of money, but I actually like the way it looks, so I will let that one fly. Actually, guys, I did not mean to click that, sorry. Um, Actually, I'm going to go ahead and do that and then add a curtain in here just so that, um, I don't know, to even out the room a little, I guess. I don't know, I'm kind of OCD when it comes to things like that. So, I'm going to go just add a curtain like that into it, and I think that lo looks pretty cozy and cool. Um... Yep, 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 yep. Okay, now that we added that, we can go ahead and go over to the fridge, grab a fruit parfait to eat very quickly before we head off to school for the day, and our homework is completed, so that is always awesome. And I think I'm going to have Ale or Nico actually go ahead and clean up the kitchen because this little kid needs to be doing some work in his life. He just can't get away with doing no chores. So I'm going to have him go do that, um, clean up a bit, and then head off to the bathroom. And then the school bus should be coming here pretty soon for him. And then um, go harvest our plants. Okay, this is why you don't do... Sh oh my gosh, guys, he just broke the freaking sink. I can't even. We're just going to go replace it, because honestly, I don't even have the energy to be doing that right now. Um... We have not watered our tree in quite some time now, so of course it is um, almost dead at this point. And we need to go ahead and evolve this carrot plant and then harvest it. Um, and then that's good. And then go ahead and harvest this. And then I'm going to go ahead and sell what we just harvested for some pretty cash. Um, 24 simoleons for that. 120 for that and then for this i would say it is 10 simoleons even though we keep evolving that trash plant it's always 10 simoleons so i don't think that, that evolving that actually helps but that may just be me who knows um the baby is crying again so we're just gonna go change diapers feet breastfeed it change it up a little that's kind of weird actually we're breastfeeding the baby while we're pregnant with another baby. But what I was actually going to check was to see if we are still... Oh, we're in our second trimester now. Um, we're still not that much bigger, I would say, getting there. But yeah, um, I'm actually going to have... No, never mind. I don't want her to have a cake. I don't want her to get overly inflated from this baby. Um, um, let me see if we have work today. Oh, we have bills, of course. Um, we owe a lot more money than we actually have. We owe 1,097 simoleons. That is awesome. Just kidding. That's terrible. We only have 315 simoleons as of now. So, to say the least, we are probably screwed. And to say the least, our power is probably going to get shut off pretty soon here. Um, I just, start, I just felt like looking at the house from the outside. I just got a random urge to do so. But I do like this house, now that I think about it. Um... I think I'm liking how it turned out, actually. I like it. So, um, hopefully we rack up enough money to actually pay the... Well, never mind, because we start work in two days. So that's awesome, because that means that we're not going to get paid until then. So I'm actually going to have him go enter a game tournament. Hopefully we get paid for game tournaments. We have to pay to be in it. So I would assume that we probably get paid if we do place in it. So hopefully, 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 hopefully we place in the tournament or else we might just lose 100 straight simoleons, which would suck so bad considering we're already running low on money. 
And it is getting to that time, guys. So, with all of that, um, I will see you guys next time. Sorry, I just realized that we probably didn't do too much in this part. Um, we did find out that we are pregnant indeed, so that is pretty exciting if you ask me. But other than that, we did not do too, too much. Same with the last part, so I hope you guys forgive me for that, and I hope you still enjoy these Let's Plays. So, um, thank you so much for watching. I always appreciate it. Um, it's great when I see that you guys watch my videos and like them. It always is, um, amazing when I see that kind of stuff. So, thank you so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.